one Bay Area hospital, the number of COVID-19 positive patients is multiplying. Doctors say if this trend continues, they will not be able to keep up. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane goes beyond the numbers and talks with doctors at Sarasota Memorial Hospital about their growing concerns. Just over a month ago, the number of COVID-19 patients at Sarasota Memorial Hospital went from a record of 43 on May 10th, dipping to only nine COVID patients on June 4th. But the relief was short-lived. We've come a long way, but we still have long ways to go. On June 30th, the number spiked to a new record of 50 at SMH. And now in just two weeks, that number has doubled to more than 100 COVID patients. This population of patients is nothing that we have seen before. Doctors at SMH say they still have room for more patients right now, but they run out of convalescent plasma daily and are completely out of remdesivir, two of the biggest treatments for the virus. Ones that end up in the ICU are extremely, extremely ill. They are very difficult to take care of. Doctors say one of the biggest concerns is not knowing the long-term damage done to the people who recover. And even though those that recover, it's not that they recover and they're doing well. What's going to happen with their lungs in the, short, in the longer term? What happens with the symptoms that persist, the headaches, the fatigue? That's why doctors say it's critical for the public to do their part in wearing masks and social distancing. We need you. Hospitals and healthcare systems need all of us. In Sarasota, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.